Hi there, my name is Tom and I'm going to walk you through assembling the TH3D upgraded hot end for the Bamboo Lab X1 and P1 printers. The first thing we are going to do is apply some thermal paste to the heat break of the hot end. Using a Q-tip is the easiest way to do this. Take the Q-tip and apply a thin, even coating to the heat break. Now with the thermal paste applied, we're going to slide the heat break into the hot end heat sink. Make sure you have the heat break and hot end part installed in the heat sink as shown. If you put it in the wrong way, it will not work in the printer correctly. Grab the included Allen key and the two titanium screws that came in the kit. Put the two screws into the heat break and hot end assembly to secure it to the heat sink. When putting the screws in, make sure when you tighten them down, the hot end is not crooked or at an angle. If it is at an angle or crooked, unscrew and screw back in each side until it's adjusted to be even. Next, we're going to apply a thin, even coating of the thermal paste to the heater block to ensure good heat transfer between the heater and the block. Slide the thermistor into the hole on the side until it stops and then bend the wires over gently as shown. Place the heater into the thermal paste. Then slide the retaining clip over the entire assembly. When you put the clip on, make sure it is oriented as shown as there is a channel on the side for the thermistor wires to exit without getting damaged. Now that we have it all assembled, we need to slide the included silicone sock over the heater block. Finally, make sure to tighten down the grub screws that hold the heat break into the heat sink. All you have to do now is remove the stock hot end and install ours in its place. Refer to the Bamboo Lab documentation that is linked below for your printer to see how this is done. Thanks for watching and as always, happy printing.